Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and I'm on top of the world. Figuratively speaking, uh, I'm, I'm stood on the tarmac here at uh, Erg Mellonflex Airport. And you can see that there's some, some action going on over there at the station, which is super. Uh, the train's just arrived. I was, I was rather hoping the train... Oh, there we go. Uh, there we are. The train is now pulling into shot. Actually, there's a good amount of, of foot traffic going on there loading up the station, which is super. Um, nice. What a, what a pleasing way to start the show. Right, yes, stood looking at the airport because at the moment it's a sad airport. It has no friends anywhere else in the world. And uh, and as a result, no, I haven't got any planes to see because there's, there's only one airport. So today we're going to build another airport and I don't know where I'm going to put it. I haven't even done a cursory, oh, where might look good. I just want to reorient the map into the right direction. But I, it's been such a long time that I'm not entirely sure where. I think this is the default direction. Is it? No, no, you had the river at the top. Right, okay, <laughs> river at the top. I, used to, I should draw a compass on the map somewhere to kind of go with a big arrow just saying north. Um, right, no, there we go. Right, so there's the orientation correctly. That's all right, I knew where everything was. Uh, as I can see, phenomenal amount of stuff just flowing around the network. It is, uh, it is impacting on the old frame rate a little bit. Um, but once you zoom in, that eases off. Now, the question is, where am I going to fly people from? Uh, and freight as well, because half the idea is that we uh, we take the, uh, the the food and tools. No, that's machines. Food and machines uh, that Erg Mellonflex really wants uh, and bring them in from elsewhere. Now, I mean, there's a machine factory just down there, but that's that's no good. No, 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 no. You'd have to you'd have to run them up this uh, labouring uh, uh, passenger line, and that's that's no help to anybody. So I think what I'll go looking for, because the main line ships plenty of food. Is uh, is a station ideally on the other side of the river that uh, that has uh, any kind of machines being delivered to it? New New York's getting some, but I don't think they're being manufactured nearby, are they? I think they're turning up so that they can be onward shipped to Mongolia, maybe. Uh, let's keep looking. It'll be somewhere. I could just bring up the factory list and and look for them there. And uh, I'll give it another 30 seconds or so if I don't discover one before I do just that. Because if there's only one machine factory on the... Uh... No, 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 no. You've got one down here. Oh, yeah, but this Picks Creek is the first thing I'm going to redevelop um, on lap two because it's a disaster. Uh, so, uh, no, no, that's that's a bad choice. Although it's also a good choice because connecting Gallifrey Picks Creek up to the airport... That's great. I mean, that's that's about as far away as you can get. In fact, it is as far away as you can get. And it's got a machine factory. What? It's. I mean, what are you waiting for? Is there, you know, is there some other grand scheme that you've got that might be useful? But I'm not going to develop this until it's it. It's the one bit that really doesn't work. Yeah. I mean, it does work, but really badly. Um. Yeah. I don't know well make a decision because otherwise this is going to be properly fascinating as far as episodes are concerned um right okay what's the recipe for this you need steel and wood uh one of each okay it's got plenty of wood perhaps unsurprisingly needs more steel and they're still on waiting to be picked up by the main line is it waiting to be picked up by the main line let's have a look via gallifrey central say what what do you what? No, this is Gallifrey Central. Oh, okay. You sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. That's main. No, it's not. Okay, what the heck's going on here? You're distributing all kinds of gubbins down there. Okay. All right. Fine. No, this is this is going to be fine. Well, if anything, it's going to mean that the redevelopment of this becomes all the more important, and therefore it's a, it's a sound plan, except that I might bump into a little bit of terrain that's difficult to work with. But you know what? This looks perfectly viable. So uh, so what we'll do is we'll stick in a, uh, a, a an airport in here, remodel the roads, because the roads are not currently in use, and, uh, and then hook up a tram line to Gallifrey to bring out some passengers. There you go. That's it. That's today's episode. That's what we're doing. Uh, I'm not cutting off anything important, am I? Nope. Right. Let's rock. Uh, right. Okay. So first, mandatory uh, bulldozing moments. 
which I don't imagine will be the last, but it is the first, so uh, we all get to appreciate that. Right, and then uh, go aeroplanes. Now, it'd be lovely to be able to get this to talk to that. Yeah, I know, but don't get your hopes up too high. Uh, now, the ideal here would be to, uh, to orient this in a way that meant it never flew off the map, but we're so close to map edge that it's going to, and it doesn't matter which rotation I put on it, it, it will fly off the edge of the map. Now, what you want is to have it talking to the end of the road there, which puts it about here, which is actually not a bad place. Okay, right, slap in a bit of road. Um, good, well, this is going smoothly. Uh, now, I doubt very much we'll get anybody want to live here, but uh, just on the off chance, I'll, uh, I'll lay in a little bit of road for it to parallel to, uh, largely because I need a little bit of road here in order to, uh, to get the, the connection to the, the station and the this. Yeah. Good words, man. Good words. Uh, right. And uh, airports. Yeah. Do you want to go cargo airfield or passenger? We're going to go passenger airfield. Uh, and then I shall, I shall customise in the, uh, the associated freight delivery uh, escapade. Okay. You know you should have electrified that with tram track to start with. That's nah, just details. There you go. Happy with that? Yeah. Yeah, no, that, that ticks the box. It floats the boats. It uh, rocks the casbah. Um, right, okay, now then, let's uh, let's customise you up. No, 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 no. Let's customise you up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, you, you talk into your radio there, sunshine. It's uh, fascinating. Um, and then uh, stick in a bit of this. Now, I'm going to have to redevelop these in the future because at the moment, uh, the road's too close. All right, fine. I can I can bulldoze the road. This doesn't bother me. I am not concerned one jot. Uh, I can I can lay it back in and make it work as well as it does now. He says, perhaps overconfidently. Well, it's cheaper than relaying the airport. I mean, it doesn't matter that I can afford absolutely ruddy everything. It's it's just cheaper. Uh, so give me a cargo terminal. There you go. Right. You've got a hangar. Yeah. We've got a passenger terminal. We're golden. We're good to go. We're we're free and frisking. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's all good. Right, stick the road back in. Only this time. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, you and you only this time. All right. So why were you why were you giving me the the run around there? Because it's it's not like it juts out any further than the others. It also doesn't have tendrils. No. The only thing that has tendrils is the passenger entrance, which causes me a, a minor level of concern, but I'm pretty sure it's going to work. Uh, anything else? Um, yeah, it would be nice if it was all on the same uh, same flatness of the flatitude. So let's crank everything. There you go. Get it cranked. And then flatten all this out of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's, a, that's the stuff. Back to your roads. And uh, bang it on in. Oh, consider it. It's not banged. You've got it wrong. Uh, there. Bang it on in. There you go. Now it's banged. Right. Ah, super. Right. Okay, good. So, right, with this all properly connected up, make sure we've still got it all talking to itself. Which it is. Yeah, you are talking to the station, aren't you? Yep. All right. Cool. There you are. Job done. That's the end of the episode. Of course it isn't. Uh, now... Uh, what are you going to do with your tram route? Because I'm going to set that in motion first so that uh, there is a fighting chance of having some passengers at least en route by the time we kick off. There, I mean, the passengers aren't going to rock up at all until the, air, the airline actually goes somewhere, uh, which obviously it doesn't at the moment. Do you want to do something dramatic, like try and go under the runway? You know I love going over the runway. Yep, that's, that's as may be, but I think that would be unnecessarily forcing it so we'll go with medium country road and uh, we'll bring that out as far as actually we'll turn that into town road just in case just in case all right and then that was going downhill so you're going to struggle here i think to to do the maneuver you've got in mind which is this one one more two more move it further away yeah move it further away nah, that's no good uh, would have been quite nice though. Yeah, but it's it's far too steep and it ends far too far away. All right. Well, think about it laterally. Okay, let's do some laterally thinking. And if you go that low, you're in business. 
Okay, yes. That was four down. What about three down? Three down, no good, that is. So it has to be four down. Okay. And then instead of uh, instead of outlying by too much, just outline the bits that you'll clip with. And it doesn't want to do that. Okay, well, outline with the, the bits you're going to clip. No, still doesn't want to do that either. Outline with the bits you're... Thank you. You're going to clip with. Yes... Right, and then uh, switch to the Wiggly Road. And then uh, bring ourselves back in. Like that. Yeah, how steep is that? That's arguably a little steeper than you'd like. Uh, so we'll we'll just take this back a little further, because it's not like anything's going to happen here. And if it does, well, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. And, uh, and then we could have this turn into something broader while underground. Go on, try it, try it, try it, try it. And then do that. Well, that's perilous and dangerous and fearsome. Oh, no, it's all three of those things. And also, I think because you're so close to the edge of the airport, you've made a mess. Yeah, but that might just be because it's drawing it in. See? Uh, yeah, you think that's not a mess? No, that's that's very clearly a mess. All right, okay. Yeah, yeah, no, no cancel that. No, no, bad, bad scheme, bad scheme. Um, right, instead, let's do something less aggressive. And, uh, and we'll come forwards a jot. Not straight up in the air, thank you. Keep it underground. Yes. Alright, keep, keep that, no, no, that's good. Right. Give me uh, electric tram track, because it saves upgrading it in a moment, which I'm going to have to do to the rest of it, and hopefully it will take without too much drama. And then do that. And then hopefully you shouldn't have a tunnel that could be described as terrifying. No. Still terrifying. Alright, we'll start working round. Yep. And then bring it up. No. Terrifying. Oh, really? We're that close to the surface? Oh, okay. All right. Well, in that case... No. You had, you had it. No, no, don't... 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 No, no, don't mess with me now. We were there. We had it. We were in... We were in business. Go straight just a little bit longer. That could start again. Round the corner a little. Just... Just... There. There. A little bit more. 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 Thank you. Right. Take that. And then bring this up to the surface. There you go. Right. Now, so it's just a matter of persevering until it gives up. And goes, oh, fine, I'll give you what you want. And I go, is that so much to ask, really? Uh, right, okay. And then uh, electrify all of... The oh, I've turned it all into Chunky Road. Yeah, do it. Fine. I'm cool with that. Uh, it was, it's worked, and therefore I'm not going to complain about that. Now, obviously, doing a tunnel is not really that exciting. Because you can't see it. You just know that it's exciting under the ground and, and go, ah, but it, but it's exciting, though. And they go, ah, oh, yeah, 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 I'm sure it is. That's a train station. Okay, right, back to buildings. Yeah, get me a tram stop, please. Bus and tram stop. Give me electric tram track and uh, slide it on in here. Uh, now, when I do the, the redevelopment at, uh, at the old Picks Creek, I may well look into uh, possible rail expansion for passengers. But in all honesty, don't think it's going to happen. The The question is going to be, are there going to be enough uh, people coming down from Picks Creek to Gallifrey who are prepared to switch to get onto the... Why are you giving me the runaround? Just sit on there. Sitting. Um, are there going to be enough people coming from here who want to go from there over to flipping miles away? You know? Are there? We don't know the answer to that. I'm posing it as a as a riddler. Um, now, I mean, the opportunity maybe presents itself to do something exciting here, where where when I redevelop the line, we go Picks Creek to Gallifrey, work our way along the coast. There must be I must have placed a coastal town here somewhere. Must have placed a coastal town. Well, you could possibly go as far as Mega City One, as some kind of uh, excitable uh, bypass. You know what else? Could make a nice high speed route. Ooh. It really would. Okay, all right, I'll uh, I'll keep that. I mean, obviously, we're decades away from high speed being something we need to concern ourselves about. But uh, you know, it's, uh, yeah, it's, yeah, you know, yeah. I thought you might. Um, right, we're all but done, aren't we? Uh, just need to uh, just need to sort out the town with a little bit of tram track, and then we're we're more or less there. Uh, so tram track, yes. 
uh, street type moderates, please. And, uh, and then tally ho. So we'll go all the way to the station. Now, there isn't a commuter route here, so I could double this tram service as the commuter route as well. Yeah, see? Two birds with one tram. Well, if they insist on sitting on the line, what do they expect? Uh, you've also got a bit more town out here as well. Oh, well, we'll go over there as well then. All right. Think it through. You don't want too many stops on your tram service. No, no, no. I'm, I'm prepared to uh, to double down on the number of trams in order to make this happen. So I think I'll probably be looking at a minimum of six trams. Maybe even more than that. I think two tram lines is smarter. One that's point to point and one that's a commuter service. And that way there'll be overlap and you'll get more people rock up. Curse you and your efficiency. I know. In which case we'll put our central tram hub in prepare to be bulldozed uh, here. Right next to the station. Uh, yeah, right on the on the stage concourse, effectively. That's a tram route uh, for passengers, which is what we want. Are we certain? Yes, we are. Okay. All right. Okay. Good. 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 Uh, and then, well, and then you need some uh, some in town stops. Uh, so we'll have one that is. I mean, up top is maybe a little bit out of the way. Just have it stopping flipping everywhere, man. All right. You know those don't work, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I mean, you, legitimately, you know those don't work. Yeah, I'm, I'm aware of how they don't work. All right. As long as you're aware of how they don't work, then when they don't work, you won't act quite so disappointed. Yeah. By don't work, I mean they don't make any money. Um they're just because you've got so much cannibalization of your passengers uh, and the distance between stops is so short you make no cash on those at all anyway let's get that going uh just uh click stations to add go on him have one of those yeah and then this one right then that one yep and then this one yeah and out here okay and then over there Hey, and then because I'm a bluff old traditionalist, we'll uh, we'll come back the other way. All right, this is if you've never encountered it before, and you have because I've done it numerous times, the figure eight route. All right, it doesn't look anything like a figure eight, but it conforms to the figure eight principle of having one central location, and it bubbles out one end and bubbles out the other end, and it forms an eight. Except it doesn't, but you all know what I mean. Uh, this is Gal. Yes. Uh, commuter. Easy. Certainly is easy. Uh, Alright, and then before I go buying trams, let's uh, do one from here. Right. Out to their port. Okay. Uh, right, and this is going to be Gal. Yeah. Uh, to ooh, airport shuttle. You're just throwing away the use of the word road. Alright, I'll put uh, road. I know it's a tram, but it's still road because it travels on the road. Um, and we're we're there. We're golden. We're into it. We're solid, and we are frisking. Um, let's now uh, let's now add a tram depot, and we'll park that just out here. Given that this land is never going to be used for anything else, just park it on park. Just park it in a nice way, please. Nicest possible way you can imagine. Close enough. That's actually quite a nice way. Well, that's good then, isn't it? Uh, right, buy some vehicles. How many do you want in town? Well, that was a 12 stopper. So we won't we won't need capacity. What would be good is speed. Okay. Uh well the Peter Witt is the uh, is the latest and greatest. Look, this does 40 kilometers an hour then. Yeah, okay, that's valid. Uh what about the old San Diego? Uh, 25 kilometers an hour. No, that's no good. That's no good. That's no good. That's no good. You know what? We'll use Peter Witt's internally. Yeah? Yeah. Or Moscow. Let's do use the Moscow F internally. It's a little bit slower, but it's all good. Uh, and I'll have uh, ooh, four of those, which is well overkill, but I'm doing it anyway. Uh, and this is the commuter. What? Where are you missing tram track? Where are you missing tram track? Okay, hold on. I'm missing it somewhere. Otherwise, it wouldn't have beep booped at me. Uh, right. Tram track electric. Yeah. Okay. Did I did I not make this electric? Oh, what a wally. Okay. All right. Fine. 
No, look, I can see the flipping electrification for it. It definitely is electric. Are trams electric? These ones are. Okay. Right. That's still showing red. Yeah. This is all... This is all good. This is all... Uh, yeah. No, look. The, it's got flipping electrification going on. As does this bit. All right. Well, wherein lies the dilemma then? I don't know. All right. Are you electrified? Yep. Were you electrified before? Yep. What about the rest of town? Not so much. Oh, well, that'll be the problem then. Uh, right. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. 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 All of this. Yeah. Go on. Go on. That's nice. My bad. I didn't, uh, I didn't toggle it on appropriately. There you go. No, you did it twice. There you are. Is that right or not? That's right. Okay, fine. Uh, uh, keep rolling. Yeah. Yeah. What about this intersection? Pretty sure that's right. Okay. You'll know soon enough when you try and deploy it again and it goes boop boop. And you go, oh, what? And you? I mean, that's Schrodinger's electrification we've got going on here. It both is and isn't at the same time. Right. That all looks like it's connected up. Apart from this bit, which is... Or isn't. I don't know. I are you connected or what? I mean, there certainly is a spider's web of... Right, let's say that's done. Um, yeah. Yeah, it probably isn't. No, I know, but you know, you've, got to, you've got to live in hope occasionally. Uh, right, you, get out. Go to work. Wait for it. Thank you. Yeah, I know, you were all hoping that it went boop boop and I lost my mind. Because um, uh, certainly that was possible. Right, okay, so that's the, that's the Moscow. I thought I was going to use a Peter Witt. No, 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 you're using the Moscow. You want something zippy to do the uh, the outer town service, which means we're going to be the use the CE22 uh, from uh, from Schaffhausen in Switzerland. Okay, how many of these do you want? I'm going to go with three, which is far more than I need. It does have to cover a little bit of ground, but it's never going to use that many people. Oh, have some have some faith in the system. I have familiarity with the system, which is what leads me to that belief. There we go. All right, we're rolling. Golden, solid, sweet as a nut, sound as a monkey. Uh, right, so for my next trick, we're going to set up the... Uh, anyone interested in riding the tram? There you go. We've got someone interested in riding in the tram. That's good. Uh, right, next, new line. Yep. We're going to go passenger side. Excitement. Yeah, it goes miles and miles and miles and miles. Yes, we are going to ride it. Uh, all the way over to the flex. Okay. All right. And uh, and we'll call this uh, Gallifrey Flex Direct. Yeah. Oh, people are going to ride that just for the name. Um, right. Okay. Here we go. This is, uh, let's see how we do. I love how people get off and on at this stop here, despite there being nothing for miles around. Uh, right. To the depot. Yes. Let's buy a plane. Right, here are all the planes we've got. We've got the Junkers uh, F-13. And uh, we've got the Vickers Victoria, which is a which is a, uh, a freight plane. Which is magnificent. Um, so, Junkers carries three passengers. All right, well, let's put five on there to get us going. I've no idea. There you go. Right, you get doing that. And then, uh, at the same time, I'm going to put... Would you put it on the Flex Direct if you're doing freight? No, because you need to go cargo terminal to cargo terminal. Are you sure it has that level of distinction? I would have thought so. All right, okay. And all the way over to Gallifrey. Well, we're making Gallifrey meaningful at least, and we're going to pick up the action there on the start of lap two. Yeah, you see it's just going into the same terminal. Yeah, get rid of that. Click it again just to be on the safe side. Ooh, it's done something different. Clicking the right bit, I, I find to be uh, moderately useful. Uh, so this is going to be uh, Gallifrey uh, Flex Connect. Yeah. I would have said you should uh, you should put those the other way around. 
I think connect sounds more like a passenger flight and direct sounds more like a freight flight. <laughs> if you like. Well, look, you're setting a precedent here. I mean, I know the plan is to only do um, uh, one other airport, but even so, you know, come up with something that you can stick to. All right. So what you're saying is connect his passengers. I might be saying that. Are you sure? And direct is... Did I rename those to exactly what they were previously? Do you know what? I don't care. Um, right. Okay, so this is... That's the passenger terminal. And uh, and that's the... Uh, yeah, you. I think I renamed them to exactly what they were already. Okay. Well, you... That was not time well spent at all. No. no. Or, or I had it named correctly to start with, and I just named it incorrectly. Right, let's check what we've got going on here. Uh, it's using different terminals, so one would assume that there is a there is an opportunity. Right, let's... No, let's hijack this plane. Plane hijack. Right, we're going on a little trip, everybody. It's a long way. You might want to have some snacks to hand. But it's, uh, it's jolly exciting. Did you buy any planes for your cargo route? Hang on, I'll do it now. You want to buy them from the other end. That way you will mitigate uh, circling to try and find a landing spot. Okay, all right. That's a station. Yeah. Uh, it, just, it just looked like it was busy and important enough to warrant it. Right, a couple of Vickers. How many Vickers? Three! Three, you'll be lucky. All right. Okay, yep. Slap that on. Oh, God. The other one. Oh, no. Which one? What's the betting I've got the passenger planes on the wrong one? Look, if it was... If it was pro if I'd done it properly, it's direct. Come on, autosave. Don't leave me on tenterhooks for too long. It's going, I'm just thinking about it. I'm not going to let you know. Well, it's done it. All right, now go and look at the... All right, Connect. That is the, the little... To, <laughs> those icons really need to sit over the top of that. Right, that's the passenger one. Okay, the passenger terminal is... Never mind train 100, I don't care. The passenger terminal is now getting a freight plane. Oh, you peasant. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, it's a good looking plane. And this is getting Connect, yeah, which has no vehicles on it. You've stuck them all on the same one. So this needs to be relamed, renamed. You know what? I'm going. I'm going this way. Freight Connect. The uh, Freight Direct. Yeah. Uh, right. Yeah. There you go. See then. Then there can be no errors. I bet they can. Shut up. Uh, and then this is. No, I mean they're all going the same way. You'd think they'd go like you've pulled your plane into the wrong uh, the wrong harbour here. And you go, oh, uh, uh, no, it's Pax, Pax, direct. Okay, and uh, no, no, that's connect. <laughs> uh, it was so close to being great, but it just wasn't. Right, you. Let's put you on the right line, shall we? Just, uh, just, just show me the air routes, you clown. Stick it on that. I don't think it does. I, don't, I think you've... No, you've not really thought that through, have you? Uh, so grab those three. Yeah. Untick whatever's going on over there, because that's just going to cause extra confusion. Uh, and then associate this with their freight planes. Freight planes. Okay. All right. Good. Now, go and take your medication. Let's jump on a plane. It's already cost me 17 and a half grand. It's carrying nothing. Uh, the world is good. Now, hopefully, and this is partly why I'm riding the plane, because I need it to have enough time to, to bed in um, before we can expect any, uh, any progress of any kind at all. Um, what I'm hoping is that that connecting train that we've got bringing steel down uh, along with lumber to the tool, uh, the, the machine's place, that I've got naffies on there already. That's the sort of thing that I should should be checking. But me being me, I bet I went, oh, I can avoid using naffies. I'll put steak cars on this, which will mean it won't bring any food. Because if it brings some food down here, then these freight planes will actually have some stuff to do, despite the fact that we're not actually making very many uh, machines. 
Right, we've pulled a Yui. We're up, up and away. Now keep your eyes open for them little yunkers. Is that one? No, that's a that's a speck on your monitor. Oh, okay. Well, we do like a speck. That's my that's my legs dangling out the bottom. There we go. Doesn't it look good? Don't answer that if you don't think it looks. Where are we going? Are you landing now? Yes, I am, bruv. Okay. I mean, yeah, because we've got to go to the other terminal. It, yeah, you you could have driven there. No, nope. I fancied doing this instead. You're an idiot. Thank you. Chocks away. And here we go. Oh, there we are. Front wheels down, perhaps? Just a thought. Yeah, yeah, we've got to slow a bit first. They are down. Oh, they are, they aren't front wheels. Sorry, the perspective is really screwing me up there. They are. They're not front wheels. You've got one on each wing. But you see, from here, it looks like you've got a front set and a back set, and the angle's just wrong. Huh. Well, they, they are. Tricks of the mind with cool failure. Yeah. Such tricks of the mind that we have. Well, if anything, it's going to space these out a little bit. That's not a bad thing. Right, well, while he's manoeuvring, let us have a quick word with this with this here train. Hello, what sort of wagons have you got there? Yeah, I had a feeling you might be. That's lumber... Pro what do you actually do? You are... Yeah, this is why I need to remodel this, because it's going flipping everywhere. You know what else? It's a very slow train. And I'm... Despite... The route's already broken, so I'm going to tweak this now. Uh, right, manage the vehicle, please. Give me... What do you want to do with this? Uh, I want to replace it. Okay. Let's put something nippy on there. Uh, Mogul, something like that. Uh, Mikado. I get the two confused. That much is evident. Uh, and then in, uh, we'll go the Nafis Universal, please. Yeah, 64. Yeah, keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. 104. That should be more than we need. Right. Okay, good. That's now rolling. Is it zipping along at a good speed? No, it stopped at a signal because this track was designed by an idiot. Okay, all right, fine, good. Now we've got to try and find a plane to catch. Well, as luck would have it, here comes one now. Okay, all right. Welcome, welcome, welcome. What do you want to fly? You want to fly Yunkers or do you want to go on this Aircraft 8? Well, I think we'll I think we'll go with uh, the big lad. That's Bristol, isn't it? Yeah, pretty sure it's Bristol. There's only two types of planes, dude. Learn one of them. Hold on. I'll uh, I'll just confirm. I'm pretty certain it's a Bristol. Yeah. You know, you can just click on it and it will tell you. It hasn't. Yes, it has. If you do that and then mouse over it, it will go. It's a Vickers. Okay. All right. We'll ride the Vickers because I have a feel. Ah, do you ride the Vickers or do you ride the... We're going to ride this chap here. Because I have a feeling we'll we'll pull an overtaking manoeuvre. I was I was trying to decide whether it would be cooler to be overtaken or the overtakee, and I've decided that doing the overtaking would be the more interesting view. I might be wrong. Yeah, you would hope this was quicker. It's a much smaller and lighter aircraft, but you just don't know for sure. Anyway, we're not carrying any passengers. Uh, but uh, it takes time, takes time, because those passengers have to originate a journey in order to uh, to decide where they're going. Right, we've got anybody waiting there? Not yet. Okay, it'll happen. I have a very firm belief in it happening. Did you send your trams out? Well, we should be able to see. Let's have a look. Yeah, there's one now, look. It's over there. All right, good. Now then, let's go catch that fat boy and uh, and show him who's boss. All right, we're already we were already faster than that is anyway. The only thing we need to hope now is that we're at a slightly different angle of attack. Yeah, yeah. Look, we're climbing way faster. Yeah, you know what we need? We need a really zesty camera angle. I'm working on it. There you go. Oh, yeah. Trying to get the zest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Passing overhead. 
Well, that's quite dynamic and interesting. I should say so. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. How can you not appreciate that kind of thing? That's splendid. Okay, right, now let's get back on and appreciate the view uh, from the... Uh, sat on the, the front of the prop. Down, down a bit, please. All right, okay, I'll just sit out the front and cause no trouble to anybody. Now then, we get to play Name That Town as we fly over the top. Well, we're in the Spartan zone at the moment. This is nothing but industry. Yeah. Okay, well, what can we see? That up there is Atlantis. Okay, good. Which means that that is Peninsula. And then over there, you've got City 17. Good. As we look over here, is that Grazer Ridge or is that Shermer? It's one of them. Okay, good. As long as it's one of them, we're not in completely the wrong location. Okie dokie. Yeah. Would be nice if there were a bit more, a few more ships around. I've got loads of ships. I think the problem with the ships is that they just bunch up a bit. Also, I'm waiting for time to advance to the point at which I can get uh, slightly larger ships going because they'll be a bit more visible. There you go. You look, there's a, there's a, there's a ship or... How many are on screen right now? One, two, three... Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine ships in view. And two more down there, if you count them. You might not be able to make them out, but I see them. They're about three pixels wide, and I can make them out. Yeah. All right, where's, uh, where's El Chuncarino? Is it still anywhere to be seen? Uh, I'll wing walk for a bit. Yeah, there it is. Amazing. Yeah, I think if you were... Pause. It, it's going to be worth it. Look, I know we're trying to enjoy one plane trip here, but I think there is a there is a golden opportunity back here on that one. Jump on board. Where's the where's the Vickers? I thought it was behind it. No, no, there's the Vickers there. Oh, you should have ridden the Vickers because then it would have been overtaken three, four times. What well, do you want to? We're paused. No, no, this is the quest for fun camera <laughs> angles, which, I'll be honest, it's a, it's a constant quest. Yes, definitely this. All right, onwards. We're gaining. Oh. Oh, that's even more fun. Yeah. There you go. Just get your, get your legs out of the shot. In your face. We may take off slowly, sunshine, but once we're rolling... We're unfreaking stoppable. And I love that there are just enough difference in altitude to uh, to not clip with one another. That's magnifique. And I'm I'm very optimistic that that is a uh, either a fluke of the way the pathfinding is written, or uh, or what, or deliberately designed so that different uh, speeds of plane. Uh, rock at different uh, different flight altitudes or paths or what have you, deliberately to avoid collision. Now, if you're because if you're running two of the same plane, then you won't you won't ever catch the the one ahead. That just won't happen because you're going to be doing the same speed. The question is, can we catch up with uh, with the one who blitzed us at the beginning? So, you're saying the Vickers has got a higher cruising speed. Intriguing. Yeah, I think they were doing 137, whereas we do 150. It's fascinating. The, the, next, the next area of potentially fascinating is how, uh, how much descent do we need to make in order to make the mountaintop? Now, we're clearly up higher than, than any of these ridges that we can see in sight now. But, uh, but how much are we going to need to drop? It'd be, it'd be kind of cool if it didn't have to drop much at all and it basically landed on the flat. But I don't think we're going to get that. Now, what are we looking at? Uh, green. Yeah. Yeah, that's a freight line. There's, there's a train doing its thing over there. It's obviously a combined line. Ah, it's one of those. Yeah, you've got a train that goes all the way out to the end and then another one that goes midway and back again by the looks of it. Okay, so what's that? That's not Miranda. No, Miranda's right up close to the mountain. Which means that's going to be the one prior to Miranda. I 
Doctor. No. No. Where's that? Ah, that's the, um... That is the Miranda loop. That's Miranda. It's not. It is. Flipping isn't. Well, where's Miranda then? If that isn't, then where is it? It's over, it's over there. There it is, right by that mountain with the white gash out the side of it. That's Miranda. Which means this is... Oh, I know where this is. That's Sunnydale. Right, okay, good. Yeah, that's the Sunnydale loop. I thought it was the Miranda loop, you see. Plane and feet. Yes, very good. Yeah, slightly disconcerting thing. We have, we have gained on this passenger plane ahead of us. And the descent needed is not significant. This is ace. Now, when a time comes, uh, Erg Melonflex may possibly develop a few high-rises, uh, which would lead to a slightly perilous uh, run into the airport. But what I'm planning to do at that point is I will block out the land so that we have a clean flight path on the way in. Given that we're not going in too many different directions, that should work out quite well. There's the, uh, there's the snake. There's the snake. That's what you should have called it. The mountain snake. Fine, but yeah. <clears throat> oh, we're going to try and cheese this guy to get into the airport first. That'd be fun. I don't think we can do. We've got the inside line, but I don't think it's going to not touching the camera. We're just going to sail this one in as is. Tilting. Why are we tilting but he's not? I don't know. This would be a very aggressive angle of attack for a landing. If you're planning on just turning to uh, turn to port and land. No, it looks like we're waving off. No, we're waving off so he can land. Okay. We're going to come around for another loop, which means we're probably going to get beaten in the queue by uh, by all of those passenger planes. Train. Nice. Yeah. It's the one thing that, that riding on the plane gives you if you purpose train, uh, purposefully hands off it is, uh, is you just see it in motion. It's just a shame it's a little bit sh juddery going around the corner, but you know what? I'll accept it. Do you want to deal with that tree? Which tree? That one, that's about a mile high. You're exaggerating. I am. Okay. Now, what you need here is figure out the freight that is needed in Gallifrey, then hook this plane up with uh, another... No, no, hit, hook this airport up with a, your second airfield, your third airfield. You know what I mean. My second connection. Um in order to take freight both ways and, uh, and make these freight planes pay for themselves because as they stand it's not going to happen i think they're going to pay if i if we get a full load on here they'll pay quite richly but uh but it will be borderline whether or not it offsets the the running cost another plane flying through a tree yeah i'll go deal with that yeah okay right good given it's not carrying anything there's precious little point in waiting for anything to happen what we are looking for, though, is any interest at all from passengers. Not at the moment. We did have a plane just leave. Here's an arriving train. We'll, we'll hold here for just a second, see if anybody goes to the airport. Surely someone wants to go to the bright lights and big city that is Gallifrey. Why? Why do you say that? You have no evidence that anybody wants to go there. In fact, all evidence so far is to the contrary. They will. It's just a matter of being patient. All right. Well, carry on being patient then. Yeah. Anyone? Anyone talk? Up the tempo. All right. I'm just, I just want to hustle these passengers along a little bit. I'm, I swear I saw passengers go into the uh, station building and then... No, they're all leaving at the other end. You created a second end b entrance, which is more impressive than the first entrance. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, maybe when the tram rocks up. There must be a tram nearby. Why must there be? Here you go. Is people turning up off the, uh, off on foot from the other end? Maybe they want to go to the flex. No, no, from the flex to the Gallifrey. Here goes another train. Yeah. Don't get overexcited. Nothing is, nothing has proven itself to be in any way desirable so far. This is connected to the road, right? 
the, those people just moved out. Yep. I think they might have had enough of the aeroplanes. Well, stuff it on. Where are you going? Tram. Oh, okay. You are talking, right? Yeah, yeah, they're talking. All right, here comes a tram now. Okay, this is, this is a big opportunity. Don't get your hopes up. Wait for it. Wait for it. Nobody got off the tram. Okay. It's not that big an opportunity. No. It'll work. I have complete faith that at some point... Oh, no, there's another train coming. You know what, the frequency of these services isn't too bad. Yeah, but they're all they're all clearing off the other end, look. Yeah. I bet every single one of them gripes about there not being a passenger footbridge to get over the line. Well, they can get knotted. Alright, yeah. Okay. Yeah. How long are we gonna sit here waiting for someone to go and ride on a plane? <sighs> well, if we were only twenty minutes into the episode, I'd say as long as it takes, but we're forty seven minutes into the episode and therefore no, we can't We can't afford that kind of time. You should be thinking about wrapping up about now. Especially if you want to do some kind of convoluted outro. Yeah. Here comes a tram. All right, we'll wait for the tram to come in. And then, oh, it's down a train. Right. Your last bet. No, the tram's going the other way. Okay. Why is it going the other way? Well, you set the route up. You should know the answer to that. No one's interested. Nobody cares. You built all of this for nothing. Oh, no. Hold on. Here it comes. So it stopped up there, and it stopped up... Hold on, those are people going into something. They're using the other entrance, folks. Oh, okay. Well, where are they, then? They should be stood about here. And at the moment, they're not. Here they come. Yay, passengers. Yay, passengers. Where have they gone now? Into the hangar. Why? Because they felt like it. We've not seen... Here they come. Look, look, look. Skirts are flapping in the breeze. Three ladies all wanting to ride the plane. This is... This is good. All right. That's one airplane full of... Aeroplane. One aeroplane uh, full of passengers. Yay, I guess. Yay, indeed. Yeah, pay me. Uh, that's... No, that's going to be good eventually right let's slow it on uh, slow it back on down there and uh, that's no, no let's go and see if we've just got anything going at the other end and then we'll call it a day all right okay yeah let's let's do that now before we call it a day I'm gonna look at where I want to put the other air airports yeah okay here's a departing plane now it's carrying nothing okay give it time you know why you haven't got any freight distribution coming from the uh, airport at the other end and therefore, you're not generating any demand. Oh, gosh, you're good at this. I really am. Is that That's my... Uh, is that... Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. There we go. It's got 104 planks of wood on it. Super. Yeah, that could cause a problem in terms of a bit of distribution down the line, you know? Well, I say down the line. I mean now. Uh, right. Flex. Talk to me. Now, airport. What coverage have you got? You cover precisely three buildings, one of which is industrial. Okay, so we are generating some demand. Don't get overexcited about that. You're going to need a little truck distribution effort here. Okay, all right. Uh, so, just a little one. Well, I say little. I mean, let's let's do one that's meaningful. All right. Okay, stick that on there. No to your electricity. Get knotted. There aren't any electric uh, trucks anyway. This is true. All right. Stick that on there. Okay, and then uh, a truck stop in town, please. Do you want to do two truck stops in town? Maximise your uh, your impact. No, because one truck stop here will satisfy pretty much all of town. Well, do it then. I've done it. Uh, right, okay, so we go from uh, uh, out here by the airport, and we go to here by the town centre. And we call that... Do we? Uh, erg, yeah, uh, road, yeah. Uh, yeah, goods, yeah, no, freight, yeah, yeah, what else, delivery, any other words, no, that's all the words I need for that one, and then we just go and find a truck depot, lo and behold, that's a tram depot, no and behold, we're going to need to build a truck depot as well, sure, no, no, it's a, this place is going to have all the mod cons, uh, right, yep, go on, stick yourself on there. 
Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. There you are. That's it. All right, straighten them up a little bit. Super. And then uh, have a word. And then how much do you want? Two? We're not even going to fill one. Just buy one. Okay. All right. And then that's on the uh, the Erg Doodah whatnot. Yep. Uh, road freight delivery. Oh, yeah, plainly. Okay, well, look, that should start jazzing up the uh, the demand, at least. And then we'll just see how we can we can level production to make that happen. Uh, nice to see this commuter line's got a bit of demand going on. That's good. I mean, if nothing else, that will help... Uh, no, we were here already. If nothing else, forget I said anything. Uh, uh, right, so, one more hop back to Gallifrey, just to have a quick look. All right, what exactly are you expecting to see? Oh, planes and that. Okay, planes and that. Yeah. Have you got any... Uh, no. All right. What about you? Uh, no. Okay, well, I'm not overexcited. Uh, Gallifrey side is 55 waiting to ride the intercity. That's quite good. Anyone fancy taking a tram out to the airport? <laughs> no. No, we just don't. No. Why would we? We people of Gallifrey, we keep our feet firmly on the ground. Thank you. Yeah, just make sure the tram stops talking to the airport. Of course it is. It's worth checking. I've been Colonel Fay, everybody. I'll be back soon with another one. Where are we going to stick the next airport? Down the other end. Twin Peaks, I think, was what we were looking at. Over here. Ooh. Yeah. Line it up for a mountain approach. You know it. Groovy. Okay, well, I look forward to, nay long, to see you at the next episode. Uh, let's sit at Gallifrey and just watch the planes passing by as I roll out talking about something. Thank you very much. I'll catch up with you soon. Cheerio. Where you go? Is it? it no, no. About there. About, about there? Yeah. This is why you use a tripod, you know. You, I mean, you had this novel idea to handhold this and do, you know, some ooh, angles. Yeah, I know, but I don't think that the ooh, angles is really working for you. Uh, so uh, sum up the episode and then get out of here. All right. Stimulating. Yes.